I've wanted to make black powder for a while, but for that I need charcoal. And I'm going to be using this wood. Um, it is pine from a tree that we cut down recently. And I'm going to use it because it's basically the only kind of wood that I have right now. And because in black powder form it burns pretty fast. I split the pine up so it will be like as thick as a pencil. And this will have more surface area so the burning process that I'll do next won't take as long. So I filled this steel container up with the splinters and it has to be steel because in the fire it gets red hot. And then the lid for it, I put like a 1 8 inch size hole for the wood gas to come out of whenever it's burning. So after you put the splinters in here, you'll want to put it in the fire and in like a minute or two, uh, the wood gas will start coming out of the hole. So once fire stops coming out of the hole, you gotta take it out and plug the hole with something. I'm just using mud, and that's to keep the oxygen out because if you don't keep the oxygen out, it'll continue burning inside and you'll end up with ashes, not charcoal. And once it cools down, then you can open it and there's no danger of it catching on fire again. So now it's cooled down to the point where I can touch it with my hands and once you get it open you end up with charcoal this is if you did it right it's pure charcoal and one interesting thing about it is that it's so light after it's done and it shrinks too. I fill this thing all the way up and it's like halfway 